No, it's, it's glued around. They glued it together. Well, yeah, I know they did, because I had to rip this apart before. I don't know if I can kick it. Can you kick it? That works. There, it's off. <laughs> that was incredibly satisfying. <laughs> we need to get the camera that will get these nails out. Yeah. There we go. That was satisfying. I don't get to kick stuff like that very often. <laughs> Okay guys, so uh, let me get over here. Um, today uh, we're going to be, I'm gonna see if I can get that, um, let me step this way, I'll step this way. I'm gonna see if I can get this uh, board off in this room, this uh, furnace room, so that um, I can get some light in there. Uh, I'm not gonna use this camera, I'm actually gonna use the DB Power because it seems to do better in low light situations. Oh, my hair is lovely. Anyway, um, good news is this window, wherever it is, there, there, that window right there. <laughs> um, we had some pretty good wind over the weekend, the Memorial weekend, and that window seems to have held up pretty well. Uh, camcorder seems to be working. So everything is so far working. Um, I think that's it for right now. So I'm just gonna try to get that board off. I'll have the other camera recording. And after that, we have several other windows that we still got to um, kind of dig into and see if they're infested, and including windows back in this uh, furnace room. So that's what today's plan is, and hopefully we can get it done. Looks like we have some weather moving in, so I'm not sure if I'm gonna actually take out any windows today. Uh, if the weather starts turning bad, I actually have a wall that I need to finish removing, and we might do that today, I don't know. So I'm gonna go get the ladder, see if I can get that board off, I've got my drill, and hopefully I will be able to show you that room a little bit better because it's been so dark that it's hard to see in there. So that's the plan for right now. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe it, and, and hit the little bell notification and do all that stuff that everybody else tells you to do on every other video because it helps the channel. Thank you. Okay. Uh, here goes nothing. We'll see if we can get the board off. This screw looks like it's a snake. Got yeah, really bent. All right, and I got two nails over here holding it. I'm gonna have to get my crowbar and, and see if I can uh, get this thing out. Let some light shine in. That'd be nice. Other than my little light there. Easier to try to get this side out first. Maybe. Looks like there's a nail over here too. I'm really not worried about any of these pipes because they're all coming out anyways. I'm not even talking to the camera. I'm not worried about any of these pipes because they're coming out anyways. And all of the services have been shut off, so uh, none of these pipes are live, I guess you could call it. I'm also very not comfortable with the heights thing right now. I'm really trying to avoid going up too far on this ladder because I don't want to lose my balance and slam into this furnace back here. I think she's right though. I think we should just kick it out from the other side before we put that stuff in. 
it's not a very thick piece of wood. It's only like a maybe a quarter inch, I guess. So we get to anywhere. Well, I guess I'll go get my hammer. See if I can get the claw in there and some of those nails out. What? Oh, she's back. I guess she needs inside the building. Hold on. Three nails holding it in. Nail hardly has any kind of head left on it. You can't check the wood of the crowbar? What's that noise? What noise? I don't know, it's beating it's the dumpster or something. Not even this. Oh. I was just leaning up against it, it was fun. That's the problem is I'm reaching above my head trying to get this thing out and trying not to fall off the ladder. Well, I'm pulling the ladder, it's fine. Well, I know, but I'm losing my balance. And... Well, then I'm going to put my hand on your push to keep your touch from falling down. <laughs> That's like no, that I'd have a hand up my butt and that would be unpleasant too. There we go. That would be more unpleasant. Now you're a puppet. That's what you want. <laughs> Can I go buy a hatch and hatch pieces? You don't have a hatch. Can I go buy a hatch and hatch sheet? <laughs> I'm just gonna take a breather for a minute. What I'm worried about is when it lets go and I'm putting pressure on it that I'm gonna end up falling backwards into this thing. Well, I can't really say if you fall above my head, I'm just saying. Yeah, I know. I mean, you would literally land on my head and I would just... I don't want to die by getting squished on my mom's ass, okay? Let's just lay that out there. That's not how I want to go out. Fiery explosion would be a nice comparison. Well, I'm trying to kind of wiggle it out rather than... It is coming out, though. Crowbar finally got it. Let's handle on it. How long is it? It's a good three inch nail. Three and a half inch. Really guys, really? You don't really need a three inch nail on this. The only one holding it now is that one right there. Why don't you pull down? Just try to really pop the board out from around it, maybe. One nail? Yeah, one nail. Wood's off. There we go. That's a good one. Woo! Right! Landed by the light. Do, 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 do. We can see it here! Oh! Oh, you're dancing in front of that with a piece of wood. Fine, don't worry about it. Oh. Yeah, boy. That was a lot of effort. Ah! Stop hitting oh. the camera. Immediately knocks out camera. <coughs> oh. You better still be recording, or I'll be upset with you. You're still recording, yay! So, yeah, we're gonna have to clean that out. I'm showing them because this is the first time we've really gotten a good look at it. What is this? Why is this all popped out of this? That was probably 
I'm, I'm saying a wood or coal chute because this probably used to be a. Uh, you it's know. Mortar. It's not mortar in very well. No, it's not. But we're gonna. Yeah, I, I'm probably gonna redo that because, or well, at least smooth it out. At least make it better looking because this is supposed to be a bedroom. So I'm gonna kind of back out here. Why don't we just put drywall up in here? Uh, well, we will. We're gonna put wood, but I I want to make sure that's sealed up. Otherwise, it's not getting cold. Because we got a hole where that pipe's coming through right there. Yeah. Got a hole right out to the back. We'll so. have to break it back in then. All right. Did my camera show. Oh no, just the screen. Screensaver. Okay. I have no idea what you guys are looking at now. Hold on. All right. Anyways, okay. here's all these giant furnaces and they use these extra bricks over here yeah at least we have some extra supplies over here yeah actually we do cool all right here's the uh stairs that we've actually been going up and down here's the other window that we still have to get uncovered so yeah this is the first time this we've this is a creepy baby ultrasound with that I, I showed them that the first time i walked through it's still creepy it's still creepy yes alas here it is still being creepy and this, this all has to come out. This? I thought we were just smoothing out the floor. Well, we may. We may actually just they might level out the floor with it. And I'm not even sure why they maybe just have a lip. dug it all out. I don't know. I don't know what their thought was there. I was thinking, like, you could have, like, you could just level it out and there would be a little tiny step up into this bedroom. I don't even know if there would be a little tiny step, actually. Anyway, that is the furnace room that we have not been able to show you very well before. Well, we showed them it, it was just creepy, dark, and spooky. Well, yeah, but... All right, I'm gonna turn this camera off since we're back out here. Now it's on. Okay, with this window here, you get in front of the... And I'm gonna go over here. Would you... This window here still has an in intact piece of glass that's just kind of falling back out. So we're just going to put a board behind it and screw it in and it should be fine. So we don't have to completely destroy this window frame that yet. Was, that was my idea. I take that one. Yes, that was your idea. What are we doing? Please help. That's cool. Yeah. Okay, so now for some reason I can't figure out how to get this thing to. I've noticed properly. that. I've noticed I think your shorter videos are more popular than your really long ones. <coughs> well, they are, but I'm not going to. I'm not going to cut out stuff that I feel is important. Important, just because people don't want to sit for through through. Some people do. Some people will. Yes, we are still trying to figure out the camera. Okay. Cut me some slack. Oh Alright, I guess that's as good as it's gonna get. We're going to leave you guys 
Okay, guys, I'm gonna put the um, window shade back on. Drapes up so people can't see in there. Are you drinking all my coffee? Mm -hmm. I don't think so. Mm. I think we should work next on uh, our window. Mm -hmm. well, I was thinking that. We should try to get the uh, polyanders in all those. I know that I mean there's just, there's still a ton of work to do. I mean we still gotta even finish the kitchen, getting all that wood out of there. It's the rest of it's still ha half intact, so it's not just flaking apart. We gotta get the cabinets out of there too. Yeah, but I if there's termites in there, I want them out because I don't want them getting to the upper, to the upper floors. All right, we're gonna work in here for a little while, guys. We are going to remove that wall. The rest of the way. I already tore half of it out, but that's definitely a wider angle on this. Okay, I'll just make sure it was out all the way. They don't need to see your eyeball. My singular eyeball. We're gonna be loud for a bit. Yay, okay. We've still got it. it. Says it's charging. Yeah, your dad, it was hilarious because I put the music on there and your dad's actually like started syncing up. I'm like, hey, that's kind of cool. <laughs> the letter H. The letter H is for happy. I don't know. Peace out. <laughs> <laughs> Just put this outside or under right ages for what in the hell do they think I know? Hey, glue this piece of wood to the wall. Good job, guys. That one is not. Oh, oh. 
whole other wood that was stuck to it. It wasn't going anywhere. Please, guys, please don't glue wood to the wall. That window off, that, that, the top board off, this bottom one can stay. And then I want to get that door so we have plastic on it. Yeah. So that if it rains, it's not just pouring right through the door. Yeah. I mean, I know if it floods back here, it's going to come underneath the door, but I mean, at least we can somewhat protect it. So are we putting wood on the outside or are we just drilling cement? I was just gonna cut some panels and put it on the screw it on the outside. Okay, do you wanna measure over it? Yeah. Oh shoot. Okay guys, so what I'm gonna do now, whichever hand I need to point with, um, I'm going to unscrew these cabinet doors. I wanna keep at least the hardware off of them. Uh, the doors are kinda cool, they're old. And I'd like to keep them, but these, this counter's gotta go away. And I think we're kinda probably going to demolish it tomorrow, but I wanna make sure I get the, the doors and the, uh, cabinets off. Oh, and we found one really kind of cool thing that we didn't even realize was there. <laughs> I didn't realize there was a drawer here. And it's got, uh, it's got some little boxes. Spatula. Uh, can opener. Bottle opener. Bunch of Padlocks in here. Um, some hinges. Not sure what those do. Lots of screws. Where I go with those hinges and stuff. So that was kind of cool. All right. Anyway, here's a cool little drawer. I thought that was it was neat that there's kind of like a handle. I mean, it lays flush. There's a handle right there. Anyhow, I'm gonna work on on getting these off. I'm just gonna take, uh, I'm just gonna unscrew the hinges and take the whole door off. So that's what I'll be doing as soon as I find my screwdriver. Unfortunately, because of all the paint that's on these screws, I can't 
I can't get in there far enough to actually get the screw to turn. I guess what I need to do, <coughs> I want to save these, is bring some paint remover and get the paint out of there. I'll have to figure out what to do about these tomorrow, I guess. Maybe I can just take the wood panel off. I'll be answering the phone for a minute. We decided we're gonna call it a day. Uh, I'll try to get those cabinets apart tomorrow. And we'll get this window with the plastic on it tomorrow so we have more light in here. Um, it's after five now and we're just tired. So, and I've got some other stuff I need to get done. Gotta go help her with a little project at her house. So, we're getting there, it's, it's taken as, a uh, little while because uh, it's only two of us and we're kind of trying to do things carefully. Anyway, um, hope everybody has a good day and we'll see you on the next video.